Uh, first thing is to align the studs uh, over the elevators of the bedding platforms. Now, as I look down, this is a Yamaha, and these studs are all in a row. And I'm just going to have a little look underneath, because the hidden studs, uh, they're in a row too, apparently. So they're all in a straight line, which means we can just center on the elevators. Often there is an offset. One of the studs is offset a little bit in a Steinway, that's the case anyway. And what I do in that case is I get the studs on the front uh, lineup to be at the front end of the elevator and the offset one to be on the back end. And um, Okay, so I'm going to line this up and I'm putting the action in the middle of the station so it's not over to one end or the other, it's right in the middle. And I bring the slipper tracks in to hug it and I push them all the way back so I have more room for my squaring platform and my uh, string height gauge. And I check that that is lined up with that rail. Come to the other side and line up the other end with the rail and back, back up its slipper track. Uh, also make sure that it's on the flange. Okay, so I check my alignment, check that that is budding. I'm going to go back and check the other side in case it moved. Uh, in fact, the silver track moves slightly. And now I'm going to tighten the front screw of the slipper tracks, which are in their final place. I'm not going to tighten up the back one yet, because the next step is to push the back rail underneath the action up against its stops. And I just want to make sure that things didn't move here. They seem to be okay. So I will now tighten the back screw on the slipper tracks. Uh, next step I'm going to turn up the stops on the front rail. And push the front rail into place. So now we have, and just to make sure that it's true, uh, the stop at the back is in contact, stops at the front are in contact, slipper tracks are in contact. We have a fixed position for the action. So I'm going to take uh, the modern, um, a more modern version of this system has uh, a different, the same mode of attachment that these three places have is available out at this end in the modern, but in this vintage there's a thumb nut underneath each of the rails.